Hills until September. I'm here, I'm here, I'm here for the whole summer and I had it sent to completely the wrong place, which was disappointing, but it does mean that I've got a mystery lucky box waiting for me back in London. Woohoo! Something, anyway. Uh, although most of it in that mystery box is for my mum and is for the birds. She's got a great big box of mealworms and some stuff, but the mystery box is going to be a mystery. The other stuff was entirely for my mother. Some jam and worms. Wormy jam. Anyway, this is a different box. I do have some suet mealworm stuff for my mum for her birds. I know this. I know this, but they, did, they were out of mealworms, the big box, so... I'm just going to have a feed bed. So I think this is the mystery box here on the top. I'm going to put this to one side, just check and see whether this rest of it is, is stuff or not. Oh no, hang on. Yeah, no, that's... This is all the stuff that I knew about. Christmas pudding and mince pies. Oh, it's Christmas in July. I have to remember what it's Christmas in July. Anyway, mystery box. Hooray! Hello! Hello, one, four people! <gasps> Four whole people! Good morning, Michelle! How are you on this very hot day? It is apparently going to be the hottest day, not only of the year, the hottest day of all time in Wales. It was 40 degrees, maybe even 41 degrees in England. I'm staying in Wales. It's the hottest it got was 32. It was supposed to be 32 here, which may, if you're from a very hot country, seem like nothing. But it is very hot here, so I'm staying inside, windows open, with the uh, blinds drawn. As you can see, blinds drawn, trying to keep cool. It was 27 degrees in this room yesterday, which is, as, it might have been higher, but that's as high as the temperature gauge goes. It was a little, uh, just show you, hang on a second. Might not be that now. So it's only 24 at the moment, because it's early in the morning, but it was all the way up to 27. This is my parents' age concern, to see whether you're gonna die of hypothermia. And uh, I think we're safe, it says, Reduce your heating. Yes, I would. 24 is still in. Reduce your heating. Too hot. Anyway, mystery box. I'm really hoping that this stuff hasn't melted because it was out yesterday, which was already very hot, but apparently it's going to get even hotter today. Oh, I went out yesterday with my little cap on, looking like um, Ernest Hemingway, and I had some sunglasses that I found. These are things, I, they're not, I don't even know where they came from. This was in a cupboard. Don't know whose it is. It might have been my grandfather's. Who knows? These sunglasses I found somewhere. Don't know where these, I, people sometimes give me bags of clothes because I'm a bit of a charity case. And uh, it probably came in that, probably. Anyway, irrelevant. I did go out in that yesterday, but what's in the box? I don't know. What's in the box, Michelle? Have you got any thoughts and ideas? And it's not going to be like the, um, the lid is mystery box with the, with the cosmetics in there. I did get some sunscreen in there that I know about. I got Factor 50 facial sunscreen because that didn't come in my mystery box last time and I thought I'd better get it. Anyway, what's in this? I think there's quite a lot of stuff in this box. Mmm, a guitar. There's not a guitar. I'm so sorry. Uh, dime bars. Ooh, you think dime bars? Dime bars? How do you know dime bars? I don't, I don't know. There? I don't know. Let's have a look. Oh, some sort of peanuts. I'm going to say wasabi peanuts. That is not wasabi peanuts. That is, oh, crunchy pretzels. Smoky barbecue. Can't eat these. I'll give these to my dad. I'm sure he'll appreciate that. Ah, so that's quite nice. This is a pound's worth of food. That's probably a pound on its own. More than that, maybe. I think there might be some more. Yes, more pretzels. I hope he likes these pretzels because I think that there are more in there. I can see that a catch of lips of them in the in the um, in the reflection because I can see the screen. The screen is shut because it's on my phone. I'm like, I can see that there's more red, and that so I knew that. I can't. I don't know. I haven't looked, but I can see from just the feel of it <laughs> that that right. I think that's. Oh, what's this? this is different. I thought there was another one. Baked. Oh, I can eat those. Baked cheese and onion crisps. Nice. What else is in the box? There's more than that. There's, oh, something else that's in a packet. Chocolate buttons or something. Minstrels. It is minstrels. Ha ha. I know my candy. Minstrels. Mmm, I haven't had minstrels for years. They're not melted. 
That's good. They've got a crunchy coating on them, so even if they did melt, they'd stay in such a crunchy coating, so you'd get like melted chocolate with it. Oh, I imagine that would be quite nice, actually. But it's not so hot yet that they are melted. Minstrels, mmm. So that's already more than a pound's worth. Oh, a bottle of something. A bottle of... Oh, I thought it was... Oh. Some... I don't know whether this is a drink or like soy sauce. Okay, I, I, I can't tell. Cider vinegar? White condimento. Ah, white wine vinegar. So I was nearly right. It's like, this is uh, vinegar. Yes, it is vinegar. White wine vinegar for my salad. Ooh, lovely hot day with some salad and some vinegar. Yum, yum, yum. More stuff in this box though. That's definitely worth more than a pound. This is probably, this is posh. This is Great Taste Awards, this Bel Azul. The Great Taste Awards. I'm gonna look that up, but I bet it's worth more than five pounds. Ooh. And vinegar doesn't really go off. It's like wine turns to vinegar. What does vinegar turn to? Wine again? I don't know, I don't think so. Okay, a little oh like a little a little round container. Can you hear that? I think there's little tiny seeds. Seeds maybe to put on top of salad, which is good for the hot. What is it? It is scrumptious. Oh, it's not. It's uh, like uh, little hundreds and thousands. So if I make a cupcake, I'm disappointed though. I was expecting little crunchy seeds, but that's nice. If I make a little load of cup cupcake, is it edible? Aqua hundreds. Yeah, they're hundreds and thousands. Aqua. I would say that's more... Not really aqua. I would say that that was more, um, oh, I don't know, maybe aqua. It's, it's, it's one of those colours that things are falling on the floor. Right, more stuff, more stuff, more crispy, crunchy. Ah, this is interesting. They're like, like a package of, a packet of that big, but it's got round things in it. I'm going to say they're like little baby rice cakes. I haven't had baby rice cakes. And also, the last time I had a corn cake, my tooth broke and I had to have it taken out. So I may have a little bit of a trigger issue with little baby corn cakes and baby rice cakes, but I think this is what I've got anyway. Maybe, I think the teeth that are remaining are not all, because that one, I had a filling in it since I was about eight. So it was on its way out for a long time. I'm more than eight now. So maybe I'll be all right now, but I'm not sure I want to, anyway, I think these are baby corn cakes. Organic, and literally, for babies. <laughs> Baby corn cakes for babies. Raspberry and blueberry rice cakes for babies. I'm not a baby, but I can pretend to be a baby. So I'm thinking that babies might have an issue with their teeth too, not having them. Maybe that's why they can have them, so they don't break their teeth, because they don't have the teeth. I don't know. There's more stuff in this box. It's not awful. You know, usually there's like chocolates and things. There's not that many little things this is big things really but there are more things in this box i'm going to say one two three four five maybe five more things okay so this is some sort of chocolate bar i don't even quite a big chocolate bar like a protein bar i'm going to say this is a protein bar it is a pros gooey protein bar so i'm right with that it's a gooey protein bar and it hasn't melted so that's good it's not it's still 24 25 in here so that's quite warm for a room not so much that it's going to be i put them in the fridge or something right okay now this is a jar and i think from the shape of this jar i'm going to guess this is something like showered showered's the shape of the jar it's sort of round and then square and i've seen showerwoods jars like um curry paste like a uh, cooking sauce so i'm going to say this is a showerwoods cooking sauce i might be wrong here it is look i knew i know i know these things i can tell from the shapes of what things are it it is showerwoods bolty now i can't tell obviously by feeling what exactly the flavor was but it was in the general ballpark of that's what it was. So, right, there's another jar. Another jar? No, it's not a jar. <laughs> my my fingers are failing me. This is definitely a can. And I'm going to say it's a can of bar. This is based on things that I know were on the on the 
available to have. So I'm going to say that it's bar, B-A-R-R, and it's going to be um, cream soda. No clue, really. Not bar cream soda. It is, oh, better, green orangeade. Mmm, organic and... Oh, that's quite nice. Oh, that's going to be nice on this hot summer day. It's going to be the hottest day ever. I, I'm Orange soda, I'm not that sure that I like orange soda. But I know when we went to the south of France with my dad's school, he took the whole family because he was looking after the kids. And we came with him. And I got terrible, terrible sunstroke. The only time I've had sunstroke. And it was awful. I was like walking around in circles. I remember I was wearing this or orange, um, so orange top and an orange skirt with black dots I look like a big carrot with black fly and I remember walking round and round and round and round in the campsite and being really weird and being just like my my head was frizzled and I was like throwing food at people and everyone's like what's wrong with Elise and I was like ah all day and then in the night I was just completely like and I was hallucinating and I was like sweating and I it was just awful. And I remember my brother coming in and saying, what's wrong with you? And everyone's like, what's wrong with you? You're just faking it. You're being stupid. I couldn't, I couldn't go to dinner and it was awful. Anyway, that's why this reminded me of that is that when we were there, we all, because I made friends with the other kids, we were all the same age. We, we all went to the like little stop store that was the campsite store and we wanted cheese but there was only boursin that was the only cheese available in france the boursin was yeah it's nice but that was the only cheese we had craving for cheese and the only drink available was orangina now this is not orangina but it's sort of reminded me of orangina and the whole hot story and the story is because it's a hot day and orangina and all the Memories, it's like an old person talking, it's like, I remember back in the day when I had sunstroke, oh, anyway, that's how I feel at the moment, old and decrepit and staying inside to keep out of the sun, there's two more things, two more things, I think one of them is absolutely a Kit Kat, it is a Kit Kat with four, four, what they call it, fingers, finger of four Kit Kat, this is definitely a Kit Kat, I do not have any doubt of that. It might be a different flavour Kit Kat, it might not be a plain Kit Kat, plain Kit Kat, but it is a Kit Kat. It's not a Kit Kat. Oh, it is a Kit Kat! See what I said, it's not the Kit Kat that I was expecting. <laughs> this is not the Kit Kat you're looking for. A Kit Kat duo, mocha and chocolate. Wow, if only I could eat wheat, I would be ecstatic to have a mocha and chocolate Kit Kat. Well, I'm sure somebody else will be ecstatic. That is an exciting Kit Kat. This is a sexy wee little Kit Kat. Sexy wee is not what, not words you want to hear together. Anyway, it's a Kit Kat, but not the Kit Kat I was expecting. One more thing. It's a box. It's a box. It's a box. It's a box. It's a shiny box. It's a square box. Now, I've got what I know is mince pie. Now, this mince pie is quite, so I thought maybe this is mince pie, but this is, quite a matte feeling and this box that it's got in here is a shiny box matte box shiny box so there's not mince pies but it could be something like mince pies now i've not clue not a, not a clue any guesses nobody wants to guess they're just mesmerized by my shiny face uh okay this is going to be the last thing and then after that i'm going to go and drink my cider vinegar like this it's not cider vinegar, white wine vinegar, white wine condimento. <sighs> that would be my day. Because it's turned to white. Milk tray. Oh, you think it's milk tray? It could be milk tray. I don't think it. Maybe it is chocolate. Oh, I don't know what it is. Right, that's a good that's a good guess. Right. Now it's about the same size as that mint. So I'm saying from the feel of it, it's the same basic shape as this okay milk tray is the guess i don't know it might be pies it might be chocolate it might be something else what is it you'll know before me because i haven't looked what is it oh that is not at all what <gasps> gluten free devil's food cake i can have cake oh approved food you know me so well i am going to have a cake i thought this was a pie that i couldn't eat which is a cake that I have to make myself, granted, but it is a cake. Ha ha ha, cake. I'm going to have cake. I wanted to have cake, and now I'm going to have cake. But I have to go in a hot 
No, I was going to say I'm going to have to go in a hot oven. I don't have to go in the hot oven, but I have to go near a hot oven. Already my brain is frizzling from the heat. So maybe I'll wait till it's a slightly cooler day to make my gluten-free cake, yay! Ah, joy. So that's good. I'm going to have some curry. I can give some pretzels to my dad. I can eat some baby food. I can have some white wine vinegar and a protein bar. And uh, maybe I'll put sprinkles on my devil's food cake. Who even knows? Maybe that's what they thought. Ooh, they like a devil's food cake. They went, oh, they love a devil's food cake with some sprinkles. Ooh, they'll send them that. Where? Whoopsie. Did I break that? I might break, I might have broken my computer. Anyway, and minstrels and that. This is a good, this is a, not the best ever for a pound, but in terms of a pound, this is certainly more than a pound's worth. Lots of stuff. So that's it. Oh, and the Kit Kat. Forgot Kit Kat. Yum. All right then. Well, I'm off to drink my orange drink and have a little lie down in a cool room now. And, uh, and think about my devil's food cake whenever I shall make it. I will see you very soon. Have a lovely week and bye-bye.